guys, this is Rico here again. Happy New Year, it's 2015. And I was tagged by my friend Evan Rogers to do my most used products of 2014 last week. Kind of take notes in this big book here. I actually wrote out my top products I'm going to be doing and that will be a series coming up next week. But for today, I'm just going to talk about the top most used products. To kind of make it simple, I just pick the things that I do tend to gravitate towards and the things that I always do use. Blue Bottle Coffee, Growing, Roasting, Drinking with Recipes. This book has been like a tremendous help. Um, it's very inspirational. It's the most used because I have checked this book out probably a hundred times this year from the library and finally I got it as a gift for Christmas. So if you guys haven't checked this out and you're a coffee lover, very inspirational, awesome tips on how to brew coffee and really good recipes. Most used way of making coffee this year for me, AeroPress. And a lot of people might not be familiar with this, it's just two-piece plunger. It's got a filter like this and the bottom cap. What I do, especially when I'm catering and kind of doing small parties and stuff, I do the Andy Springer method, which I kind of talked about in one of my videos. It basically uses a V60 in the top like this. And I'm basically, it's kind of combining the AeroPress with a drip, finding those two, and it makes a really, really good cup of coffee, and it's very entertaining to watch. How to grow a mustache now, Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements pre-shave against the grain shave soap. This stuff has an awesome smell. Every time I go shave, wash my face with this stuff and it helps and it works and I love it. Honestly, I didn't pick a brush because my Pure Badger, which was my first brush, my Silver Tip Nathan Clark Custom, my Plisson, a Travel Bore brush, and a, a Mega and I'm pretty consistent about rotating through all of those brushes. So I don't really have one that I'm very, that just sticks out that I'm just, I love. I love each one of them for different reasons. So I don't have a, a go-to brush. So that one's gonna have to be all my brushes, I guess. Astra Superior Platinum in the green package. These just give me a, cons a consistent shave they're very sharp very smooth so this is my go-to razor blade the razor rock mission mild enough that you don't have to worry about crazy irritation like some aggressive razors aggressive enough if you haven't shaved for a while it cuts through it like nothing heavy duty well built i love the knurling on this pretty nice heft and this has just been like a really great go-to razor so the Razor Rock Mission, and it's an excellent deal. Like, I can't say enough for what Joseph's done over at Italian Barber. Get a razor of this quality at this price, like 20 bucks, I think, plus razor blades is just awesome. So I love it for all those reasons. It's just a great, great razor. How to Grow Mustaches Gondolier, but I just love this. It lathers so easy, and I've actually been experimenting. I normally use filtered water when I shave, but... We've got kind of weird water in my house, but I've been experimenting with just using water out of my faucet and this lathers up no problem. It's got great ingredients, smells awesome. It's like one of my favorite scents, floral, a little spicy, fresh, clean. It's, it's uh, everything I'm looking for in an awesome scent and an awesome soap. Yuzu, I use this almost like every day. <laughs> I just love this scent. It's very citrusy, spicy, intriguing, clean, and I just love it. It's a, actually, I'm gonna spray some on. This is awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's just got, it's grassy, spicy. It's just a wonderful scent. Aftershave, Captain's Choice Sandalwood. I put this on way more than I should, and it's one of my newer purchases as far as aftershapes go, but I love the way this feels. I love the way it smells. This is top-notch stuff. This is how weird I am about scents and stuff. Sometimes I put this on before I go to bed, even though I haven't shaved, just so I can smell good when I go to sleep. That's kind of messed up, but <laughs> I love this scent. It's awesome. Razor Rock Alum Block. 
This thing has been like one of my best tools in shaving it. Gives me feedback at the end to let me know if the shave was really good or there might be some irritation. And if there's any nicks or cuts, it stops the bleeding and it comes in this cool case. Put it on after you're done shaving, rinse it off and you're good to go. I love this stuff. For shaving would be my rooster mug. I got this on vacation. I just needed something to sit my brush in. I like the design on it. I think I got this for like 50 cents. It's just cool. I, when I reach for something to put my brush in, it's, I tend to gravitate towards this one because it looks, it just looks awesome. The Beard Baron's Waikiki. This was a limited edition mustache wax. I love this stuff. It has great hold. It smells really nice. It's more of a summer scent for sure because it's very Hawaiian. If you put too much wax on, you will be smelling this all day long, but it's easy to use, good hold, and it's just great. I love the container. Great design. I love the little logo. I don't know if you guys can see that. So those are my most used products of 2014. So again, I want to thank Evan Rogers for tagging me. That's really cool. I enjoy your videos, Evan. You're awesome. I'm supposed to tag some other people, and I was going to tag G.I. Jam and James. Chris Bailey beat me to it. And there's a whole bunch of other people I could tag, but instead I thought, let's make this a little more social. And I'm curious to know, to all the people that watch my videos out there, if you're a wet shaver or a coffee drinker, comment below or make a video and put a link underneath. And let me know what is the top products you have been using for 2014, your favorites, the things you have been going to that are your number one. Just be kind of cool to see, kind of get you guys involved. I just want to wish everybody a happy new year. Thank you for watching. I appreciate it a lot. It's awesome. I love interacting with everybody out there. And I hope you have a blessed new year. So God bless. Hope you're having a good one. Talk to you later. See you.